It's Fantasy Football Draft Day, and I'm featuring this L.A. beer. Oi, oi, oi. Hey, hey! Who goes there? Much appreciated. Welcome to Bruce with Beck. Welcome to Bruise with Beck. I'm Dan. How the hell are you? Uh, so stoked. I've got two drafts today. Uh, two very personal. A family in a pr- my biggest league draft. Uh, very very stoked. Uh, so any of y'all that are part of it, give, you know, just give a little like. The beer I got in front of me. Uh, we, uh, me and my good buddy uh, Jeff, when we were at All Seas and uh, on Friday, we split a four pack of this, and I'd have it before uh, All Season Brewing out of Los Angeles. This is Cloud Racer. Uh, 6.5 on the Richter. Tap in. Uh, it's one of their uh, most known beers. Uh, this is just a straight up New England IPA that uh, has Citra, Moteca, Talus, and Eldorado in it. Uh, I looked up Talus because sometimes I forget what that has. Uh, it's supposed to have grapefruit, floral, stone fruit, potpourri, woody, cream, pine, and resinous notes. We'll see what we get with with all of that. But uh, so far on Untapped. Uh, 730 people have had this, giving it about a 3.8 out of 5. I will let you know what I'm thinking today along. I'm not going to let you know who I'm drafting because <laughs> keeping that all right here. But uh, anyway, let me know how you did in your drafts or if you're drafting today. Uh, you know, ready to get this on. Let's put the football down. And uh, let's roll. Los Angeles beer. Draft day. Labor day. Excuse me. can't believe I didn't bring up Labor Day. All right. All I ask, every damn time, please crush the hell of that like button. And if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe. That way we can sit down with glorious cold drinks like this anytime you want. Mono y mono. All right, all right, all right. Please like and subscribe. Thank you so much. All right. Looking nice. You can tell you could already pretty much call that a dome of foam right there so that's going to be the dome of foam and then i'm going to come back when it's actually ready to drink all right john is that ready to drink you betcha you betcha buddy all time best quarterback you can debate me um all right but i'm in the football mood today so let's uh let's get a smell by the way uh all season brewing you should go to a really nice place especially like afternoon session Nice uh, skylights coming down with a nice uh, light. Really good uh, place to have a, have a beer. So let's get in there and see what we got on this one. It's got Talus and Citra and Moteca. Cloud Racer. Getting some back-end lupulin uh, uh, pepperiness, I think. And I would say just a little, uh, you know, lemon-lime. Uh, lemon-lime dankness. A little bitterness. All right, well, I'm going to go from there, but let me know if you've been to All Season. I know it's a very popular place uh, on the rise in, in L.A., so right off of uh, La Brea and Wilshire, basically. So let's get in there. Cheers on a fantasy football draft day. No words, just emotions. Wish me luck to dominate. Let's go. Ooh, almost, almost has like a funkiness to it, almost... Uh, I don't know if that's no. Well, it's definitely not Nelson. <laughs> Dad would love hearing this. Almost like the, uh, in a good way, almost like kind of a funky sock kind of uh, esque thing going to it. Some creamy, funky, uh, herbal and grassy notes. Uh, a little bit of malt, maybe a little bit of grapefruit and malt. Um, but again. Nice and easy going. I mean, again, it's not too big. 6.5 on the Richter. I'd say mouthfeel on this one is, yeah, probably 50 out of 100. Night, you know, it's not too huge, uh, being 6.5, um, and does, but doesn't feel like 6.5. Again, I'm catching a little bit of like a bready, doughy malt. I probably would have guessed seven on this, so pretty would have been uh, just about right. But you know what? No, it kind of has a drinkability to it. And you can feel it's a little lighter, so I don't know. Maybe I would have guessed 6.5 if I would have been midway through this one, but nice looking can. By the way, 
Good beer, good times, good folks. Like that, like that. Um, let's continue. I got seventh pick tonight. Uh, Justin Jefferson, St. Brown. What would you do with the seventh pick? So tropicalness, little doughy bread. Um, give me a second. I'm going to see what other people were talking about on here about it. See if there's any good comments. Uh, I think we'll give it a grade and then get the hell out of here so I can go study long, study hard on uh, what quarterback I should take. <laughs> All right, let's get nuts today. Draft day. Justin Jefferson might might be in my future, but you know what that comes... Got to get the good old Cole cock out. Again, I was, this was a gift back in the day. Just been sitting there for a while from uh, Mr. Sprague's cold cock. I have no idea what the value of this. I feel like I've seen differing stuff, but... It is a sweet herbal whiskey, so American whiskey. Cheers. Palate cleanser. Definitely got an herbal sweetness to it. All right. Well, let, let's dive back into the beer after that palate cleanser. A um, couple people with a couple comments on Untapped. Uh, one says, my first all season, nice, hazy, medium, light in body, but nice, slightly sweet profile. Uh, another person, juicy, nice level of bitterness, not too sweet, loved it. So people seem to kind of kind of enjoy it. And then one more on Beer Advocate. Um, taste of boozy pine, strong orange and grapefruit with a bitter pine finish. Uh, one of the best beers at this brewery. Definitely something you need to try if you go. I would say, yeah, I mean, if you're, if you're going to go and you like IPAs, uh, hazies, I mean, this is probably going to be the one there for you. They've, you know, they've got other ones, but this is probably eh, maybe their best. So cheers to that. I mean, I just get a really doughy finish to this to go along with, you know, maybe even some pineapple, uh, grapefruit, and like subtle orange. But, uh, and like I said, there's like a, a funky herbalness to this. But uh, I'm going to reiterate the draft thing. If anyone has any sleepers out there that they think are amazing, let's leave those in the comments right now just for fun. Okay? Okay? And let me know how your Labor Day is. Everyone should be mostly off today, so. Let's drink, let's drink, let's enjoy. I know I'm going to. So, you know what, Sla slamming uh, moment, let's get this done. <sighs> Hit the spot, that is a beer. Um, yeah, pretty good. In this lovely draft day, Stella down to hell no. I'm going to say nothing amazing, but definitely decent. I'll give it a 91. All season brewing uh, in Los Angeles, right off La Brea and Wilshire. Really good place to go. Definitely going back soon, not too far from me. So uh, hit me up with any comments. Let me know, you know, what you're drinking, doing, anything. If you've been to all season, if you've had this. Uh, again, those sleepers, whatever you want to tell me. Biggie Ups, Champ Bailey. Terrell Davis, even Philip Lindsay, and uh, my man Johnny Oway on draft day. And uh, that's about it. Happy Labor Day. Like and subscribe. We'll see you out there. Peace.